five theaters of Ayala Cinema in Metro Manila and in Augusta City, where the films are reported to be a big hit. <laughs> lineup of films. Films that embrace the stories of the elderly and the children in different sectors of society, in various places and times. Stories that evoke memories of a distinct period of history and touch on the consciousness of those born after that period. And there are stories of faith and magic. Stories that rekindle our own humanity. The lineup of films this year has sparked a wider interaction between filmmaker and audience, a rapport felt in all the theaters, which was nothing short of phenomenal. This has been a very good year. We thank the filmmakers for producing their films. We thank the audience for their enthusiastic participation and feedback. Despite the rains and floods, despite the challenges to Cinemalaya through the years, you have come to the festival, watched, and helped it grow to what it is today. Tonight, we will see how this year's edition ends with the awards and citations, which cap the more than one year competition process. We thank the jury, from whom we learn to better appreciate and understand film, and through whose eyes we learn to see our films from a universal standard. Tonight's closing does not mean the end for the films in competition, but a beginning after their debut in Cinemalaya. We wish you all the best as you find your audiences here and hopefully abroad through the right distribution. It is also the beginning of the Cinemalaya competition process for 2019, our 15th year. For the 10 selected finalists, we hope that lessons taught us this year as in previous years will benefit you as you begin production. Rest assured that cinema, the Cinemalaya community of filmmakers will be very supportive. This early, let's pitch in together to make our 15th edition next year an even bigger success. Mabuhay ang sinibalan.